Hey everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. Thanks for coming on by and checking out this video. Appreciate your time and your support. About a half hour ago, I received a software update notification from Google. An over-the-air OTA software update for not just the Google Pixel Fold, but for a lot of other Google smartphones as well. And we're going to get a good look at the list here in just a moment. But first, I'm going to read this information. Hello, Pixel community. We have provided the monthly software update for July 2023. All supported Pixel devices running Android 13 will receive these software updates starting today. The rollout will continue over the next week in phases depending on the carrier and device. Users will receive a notification once the OTA is available for their device. We encourage you to check your Android version and update to receive the latest software. Details of this month's security fixes can be found on the Android Security Bulletin. And there's a link there that you can tap into to find out that information. Thanks, Google Pixel support team. And you can see here we have global, all the devices listed under global meaning that my Fold's definitely going to get it because it's waiting there for me. And uh, I have the 7 Pro and the 7. And I think that's all I have. My son has the 5. Okay, very nice. Japan, T-Mobile and MVNOs, Google 5, US, Verizon and MVNOs, U.S. What's included? The July 2023 update includes bug fixes. The July 2023 update includes bug fixes and improvements for Pixel users. See below for details. Battery and charging. General improvements for charging, battery usage, or thermal performance in certain conditions. User interface fix for issue occasionally causing lock screen notification text to display behind unlock UI elements. All right. So let me know down below in the comment section if you have received the OTA, the over-the-air software update for your Google Pixel Fold or for any of the devices in this list. Now, I've seen online, whether it's over at Twitter, uh, different tech websites, videos over at YouTube, um, there are those of you struggling with charging battery and overheating now i've spent a few days out in bend sisters in redmond oregon there's a lot of mountains out there to do some hiking and exploring where it those areas are going to be a little bit more on the cooler side because you got a lot of shade from the trees and there's creeks and waterfalls so shooting a lot of video taking a lot of pics uh, battery did good no overheating whatsoever when i was out in the deserty areas and i mean it was desert and it was hot. I was still shooting video and taking pictures and there was still no overheating with my Google Pixel Fold. And uh, I think that the the uh, best part of that was uh, obviously not the overheating, but not getting any message that my device was going to overheat and shut down. So that's a thumbs up. Now, charging is a little slow. The other day, about a couple days ago, I decided to use my uh, OnePlus Red Cable and my one plus nine pro wall charger and it actually charged a lot faster so that's what i'm going to use going forward as far as the thermal performance of certain conditions i'm, I'm going to have to assume that's the heating and which again i didn't have any overheating but there are some of you out there not just with the overheating but your battery life and the uh and the charging uh all of these uh these areas specifically a lot of you uh are, are experiencing uh, maybe one, two, or all three. I, I don't know. For me, I, I've, I've had a great time with my Fold. I've been very fortunate uh, with as much as I do not to experience any of these issues except for some slow charging, but not extremely slow. But hey, you know, using the, the, the OnePlus uh, accessories is working for me, and that's great. But if this is even going to add a little bit more to my Fold, uh, you know, as far as if I was going to experience anything, hopefully this is going to help uh, anything I might have experienced down the road. And for those of you still experiencing any of these areas, uh, these issues uh, that you uh, will get uh, the fix that you need. And you can let me know down below after you get the update, you install 
you download it and install it um, if you see a difference in charging your battery usage uh, you know your screen on time being able to get through the day uh, and uh, if there's any uh, thermal uh, performance issues um, any overheating so yeah let me let me know man I'm, I'm interested to know and um, so far for me this this smartphone here uh, has been amazing and yeah man I am in love it's definitely been way over a week we're heading into two weeks and uh, nothing says hey I got to return it nothing so anyway thanks for watching God bless you all peace I am out